Hello everybody, this is T with Kate's Craft Tea's Closet showing you the new items that we have in the store. So the first thing let's go ahead and get started with are some Dino Wakely Mixed Media paints. These are heavy body acrylic paints. This is an ocean, which is a blue. Then we have an evergreen. Okay. Then we have lemon. Then we have marine, which is a nice deep blue. Um, then we have eggplant, nice purple. Then we have cheddar. Then we have ruby, nice little red. All right, next up we have a Nouveau spoon, craft spoon, great for embossing powders and glitters. Scoop them out of the containers, makes it easier. Then we have a Nouveau, this is an aqua shimmer pen. This is one called Opal Quartz. So it has a nice cool shimmer to it. All right. Next up we have this Nouveau embossing powder. Um, it has a glitter one, I think it's called, yep, Snow Crystal. So that, have that. Then we have a slimline, these are stripes from Pink Fresh Studios. You have three different sizes of stripes and each one cuts out four stripes on each one. So those are for your slimline die. Some of my cards. Then we have a Sizzix die from Jen Long. This one is called 3D Rose number two. Okay, next up we have a Sizzix die. This one is called Ice Icelandic Poppy. We have that one. Then we have a Slimline stencil from Pink Fresh Studios. This is a cloud builder. So essentially that's what it's going to do for your Slimline cards and projects. Then we have a Sizzix and Tim Holtz die from the new Chapter 1 release. This one's called Cafe. It is a colorized die, so you have the different colors and you layer them. On top of each other, you get two different coffee cups. Cool. Then we have a Sizzix Tim Holtz die. This one is called um, Brushstroke Floral Flowers Number 1. So we have that one. Then we have an MFT die. This one's called Color Blast. It's like a rainbow coming down so for your car fronts. Um, then we have Tim Holtz. These are dies. These are the Village. Yeah, paper Village dies. Okay. Then from Pink Fresh, not Pink Fresh, my bad, Pink and Main, we have these Mod Stitch Rectangle dies. One of my favorites to use for making cards. Great base. Then we have Sizzix adhesive sheets. These are six by six, and you get 10 in a pack. Okay. Then from Pink and Main, we have this daisy die. So right here, makes little daisies. Don't need a stamp set with that, just a standalone die. Then from Waffle Flower, we have this Be a Unicorn die. Okay. Then we have from Sizzix and Tim Holtz, this one is called Bloom, it's a colorized dye. So it'll tell you what colors to use on the layers. Okay. Then we have a Tim Holtz Sizzix dye. This one is Brushstroke Flower number two. Then from Simon Hurley Creates, we have this marble six by six background cling rubber stamp set. Okay. Then we have from Simon Hurley Creates. This is a, um, these are stamping foams. I did a demo on these on YouTube Live and Facebook Live if you want to see how these were used. Okay. Then we have Tim Holtz Impresslet, a 3D frame. Yeah, floral frame. Then we have this Impresslet 3D. It's a Gerbera Daisy. So cool. Then we have some 
Dina Wakely. These are acrylic sprays. We had that in cheddar and turquoise. Okay. Then from Dina Wakely, we also have some collage paper. This is just plain, stamp on that, put it onto your projects, art journaling, mixed media projects, and stuff like that. Then we have also from Dina Wakely collage paper. This is called Just Words. So there's just a whole bunch of different words on there. You can stamp paint on that as well. And next up we have a Bow Bunny script texture stamp set. I really love these, these are awesome. They've been very popular too. And the last product new to the store that's restocked is a speckled egg embossing glaze. So that is all I have for you today, what is new in the store. I wanna thank you for joining me. So make sure you check out kateskraftycloset.com for all these new products and other products as well. If you ever have any questions, feel free to reach out to me via Facebook or email on the website. And I wanna thank you all for joining me and have a craft tea day, y'all.